Hi everybody, this is James with Gadget Review, and today we're going to take a quick look at the Razer Anansi MMO Gaming Keyboard. Unfortunately, I flubbed the unboxing, uh, so instead of actually opening it up, we're just going to take a quick look at the keyboard itself. This is a standard uh, full, full on QWERTY keyboard with five left hand buttons and then seven under the spacebar buttons that can all be programmed as well as the entire keyboard being completely programmable. We also have a full set of media keys here on the top and uh, these all work with the function button here. So if you hold down the function button and then you can select any of the media keys and they will automatically work. We also have a set of two keys here. This one, if you hold down the function key is for brightness of the keyboard. So as you can see, there is a backlight on the keyboard, which constantly changes colors. And if I just hit this button while holding the function key, it'll actually get brighter or it'll stop showing light at all. So right now it's no light. First level of brightness, second level of brightness, and finally third level of brightness. And then off again. Finally, we have the uh, G key, which if I activate it, turns on this light on the right LED and it also makes sure that if you push either of the Windows keys, uh, if you push the Windows button, it does not activate on the screen. Unfortunately, as I just found out, if you hit the uh, menu uh, drop down, it will activate, uh, which shouldn't happen, but uh, apparently it is. Just the same, all the keys are programmable on the uh, Anansi and that gives you quite a large selection. At the same time, the under the uh, spacebar keys, which there are seven, five small ones and then two larger ones, are very easy to reach with either hand, assuming you have both hands on the keyboard. If you don't, and you have your hand on the WASA, uh, WASD keys, for instance, you can still reach pretty much all the keys with just a slight movement. And uh, without moving, you can reach at least five of the keys, including the two larger ones and the three closer ones to the left side. So that is the Razer Anons. So it's going for $100 and its estimated shipping day is actually today, which is uh, February 1st. It's not currently available, but if you pre-order it, it should be shipping today. Uh, we'll have a confirmation of that in the write-up below. This is James with Gadget Review, and uh, thanks for watching the Razer Anansi first look.